Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This ultrasound video shows dilated gut loops with intestinal obstruction in a child of about 3 years. You can see the gut loops in the right iliac fossa and in the lower portion of the abdominal cavity near the pelvis. You can see the gut loop measures about more than 20 millimeter, more than 2 centimeter, The main finding in bowel, bowel obstruction include dilated gut loops with or without the presence of fluid levels. This is the gallbladder and the liver. On ultrasonography, bowel obstruction is considered to be present when the lumen of the fluid filled small bowel loops is dilated more than 3 cm in adults. The length of the segment is more than 10 cm and peristalsis of the dilated segment is increased as shown by the to and fro or whirling motion of the bowel contents. You can see the whirling motion of the bowel contents, to and fro movements. Again you can see the measurement and it is about one point seven centimeter and the patient is of about three aged about three years so the gut loops are grossly dilated on spine images small bowel obstruction often demonstrate a step ladder pattern of dilated loops of bowel that appear to be stacked on one another. Variable amounts of gas is seen in the colon depending on the severity and duration of obstruction. A gasless abdomen can also be seen if distended loops are fluid filled. Radially accessible in the emergency department, abdominal ultrasound can facilitate diagnosis of small bowel obstruction and imaging mortality an imaging modality readily available in the emergency department bedside ultrasound can assist in quickly diagnosing this condition. Again you can see the measurement is more than 2 cm. Now the most common causes of intestinal obstruction are Small bowel obstruction is caused by the variety of pathological processes. The most common causes of small bowel obstruction in developed countries is intra-abdominal adherence, accounting for approximately 65 to 70 percent of cases, followed by hernia, Crohn's disease, malignancy, and valvulus. You can find some important information in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel. If you do like this video, please click the like button. Thanks.